everybody. Welcome back to Goldcrest Valley at Mr. Blue Farms. Host of the show, Mr. Blue, me, a.k.a. Tommy Miller. We're fishing up where we left off. Got Bill Bob, uh, Billy Bob over there and Jim Bob here and, uh, uh, and me and this. I went ahead and, uh, done a couple things off screen to catch y'all up. I went and got uh, the hay bale picker upper. Uh, got one bale that rolled away hay down here. This truck probably won't do it. Well, let's try it, folks. I know this probably, I've never seen a truck do it, so that's why I said it probably won't. It's a lot of weight there. Being a single wheel, we'll, we'll try it and see. Uh, let's see here. There's no bell. I think it's right down this way. And folks, I went ahead and uh, well, I did, and uh, baby girl went ahead and finished this field for us. Uh, she didn't do too good. It wasn't her fault. The tractor, I guess, but kept on messing up I had to she did go down and stop or got down there and she come down this way turn back on this side and go down and do the whole field over this way I think it was cause uh, if y'all checked out the episode last episode the trouble I was having that's cause I picked up the end pieces and I think that threw uh 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 folks truck won't do it you see that it is yeah we're squatting the truck real bad we're gonna have to park it right here so the truck will not carry that I was hoping it would but I do have an alternative uh, y'all probably gonna be mad at me too I did a couple missions off screen can't park too good anyway I'm gonna park at the office here. I took that tractor off the wind roller and put them on here because these trailers are full. I'm gonna go ahead and catch this combine. Let's see. I guess I'll catch this one. I should be able to beat him to the end and get his pipe out. Oh, he's got his lights on anyway. Uh, I forgot where I was at. Please hold up. Hold up, Bob. Good. Okay, that's all that in hold. We're just gonna put this in the silo for right now, y'all. But uh, yeah, I know you blocked. I was blocking. Wow, I did collect the eggs last night. Uh, well, last night on the game. Uh, this is actually the day after. Cause I spent time up a little bit. Ah, that's. Yeah, Right beat and white to unload. Let's swap through. Uh, we got him over there. Uh, let's see. Both combines are full. Let's see, both of them are on the wrong side. So, go to Jim Bob here first and uh, unload him. Now, go get Billy Bob. Anyway, folks, uh, sorry to be rude. Uh, how y'all doing? Uh, if I don't forget, I think I will see this one on Thursday. I'm recording it on Tuesday, so I hope I don't confuse y'all or whatever. But this just helps me out doing it this way because I have time to edit and stuff before it actually gets. You know, I don't have to rush around, edit, and make mistakes and stuff. I can actually take my time, watch it for my goof ups and stuff. Uh, let's circle around while he's doing that. Ain't too much things changed. Ah. So, yeah. Alright. We can go over here and catch the other one, and then we'll look at our map and stuff. Ooh, doo -doo 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 -doo. 
shoe. Oh, he stopped on us. Okay, I'll give us time to look at the map stuff. So. Alright, as you can see, this overnight, folks, from where we left off, this overnight, they got down that low. And look, folks, we got another pig. We had nine the last episode right at the end. We got another one. I fast forwarded up to this point, and now we have 11. So pigs are going to produce pretty good. Now, cows, look at the growth on the cows over. The sheep ain't too bad. But we're going to have to get the cows some more food and stuff so I can reproduce more. Uh, pigs, I guess the only way we get money out of them is to go sell them. So I don't know how much they would sell for. Cows, you know, we can sell them and get the milk from them. The sheep's just going to do wool pallets, so. though. We done five bells this episode and eighteen last episode. So, Is that right? Well, this is our first time doing bells. No way! Wait! Wait! Yeah, we did do bells. I don't know what I'm thinking, folks. Anyway, let's look at the map real quick. Uh, 19 and 16 is ready to be harvested. So we're going to have to go over there next. Uh, folks, I got bad news. All our fields are going to have to be plowed this time around. So, yeah, I know it's a bummer. Might have to get by enough plow. Uh, I really like doing the missions, folks, because. I got the bank paid back. I done quite a few missions, so you know it's not the uh, how am I gonna say this? The missions, you know, we don't get a lot of money for the missions, so you got to do a lot of missions. And I don't really want to bore y'all over the missions. You know, I probably could do them and fast forward them, but that, that, I done at least. 10 last night because I want to play this game a lot. I went up to like field 5, fertilized it, and got like Buku's money off field 5. And what's the other field? I think I did 25 uh, in a. I think I've done 24 again, 23. So yeah. Doing the mission is about the only way you're going to get a lot of money right now. So, anyway, let's quit running our mouths. The combine is going to be done here in a minute. We're going to... Oh, he got his pipe out because he ran across this. So that combine over here had his pipe out, but I didn't unload them. So I was wondering what was going on. Anyway, folks, that buzzer comes on when you're about half loaded and it goes off right when you get full in case I wasn't wondering about that but my goal I don't know if we get it done this mission or not I mean this episode this mission thinking about missions but uh what we need to make our goal is to get these hay bales up to the pigs and cows, especially the cows. Uh, the pigs don't really need that many. So I'm thinking about taking them eight up there and rest them to the cows. We need to stack up on the cows. And then uh, the mid the, I guess I say mission. the next episode after this or the next we need to do a lot of grass cutting so we can get our hay build up and our silage build up. So, yeah. Ah, here we 
guess that's what I'm going for. But, uh, I guess what we need to do, uh, time being. Ah, no, 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 mister, don't skip. We need all we can get. I guess we'll work on this while the combines are working. We'll just have to keep our eyes on them. Kind of cycle through every once in a while. Oh, just like this. Uh, both of them got their lights on. We'll empty him real quick. Uh, I hate this turbo. I'm on the wrong side. Alright. Pipe out. Hope it don't take so. It's going to be an interesting, I hope. All right. Oh, I'll pop down. Oh, there we go. Let me switch back to her. Argo wagon, go catch this combine up here. We'll go see why he's unloading. We'll take the other combine to yeah, field 19, be the closest. Get him started there. It's canola. Folks, we really, really, really got to get these combines upgraded. Uh, come on. There we go. Hit the wrong button setting the cruise. Yeah, see, folks, we can just jump right across the road here. Yeah, it looks like canola. Um, square it up. Folks, on this field here, I've been thinking. This end won't be too bad, but that end down there, I would like to take it as close to the highway as possible. Getting out that way, and then try to do it that way. And I don't know about that. We might can take it a little bit further that way. Let's see. This guy's 80%. This is going to be what shrill. Uh, pipe out. I'm just going to dump in him real quick. He's over 21. So. Let's go ahead and try to make another bail real quick. That's probably what we're going to have to do, just jump back and forth so we can keep him busy. He's almost done over there, so uh, I shall get him emptied up and stuff before the oven. I ain't going to worry about that a little bit. What the heck happened there? Yeah, looking at that one spot there, folks, and lost my concentration. Okay. Rebel trailer, there we go. Got him drop back. That is part of the time. Or what is it? There we go. We had done a little flat piece there. 
Well, we're going to unload these two trailers, take him over there, and we're going to leave this bad boy to unload the heat. Say right here. Say heat. What the? Oh my goodness. What is going on here? Why oh, are we skipping? Anybody know why we're skipping? I sure don't. Maybe it's time I didn't get them over this right. Scoot them over a little bit. Okay. Are you still good? Let's uh, get this dumped. The grain auger wagon there will catch the last of the wheat. And we'll get this guy dumped. Bring him over to canola. Maybe one trailer for the canola and one trailer for the beans. Or maybe the auger wagon. Uh, unload, please. Make another bail real quick, or try to. I don't know what happened there, folks. I really don't. Uh, but anyway, that's part of it. I'm gonna get this done. All the bales done. <clears throat> get all the straw picked up out of this and we're going to pick the bales up off of it real fast and then uh, we might just go straight to plowing we got to get some things rolling here and folks I think the money we got right now I'm just going to leave it alone until we need it I guess they're doing all right. But yeah, we're going to leave the money alone, I guess, for right now. So we uh, get a little bit more saved up. We really need another tractor, and we really need to update. All right, make one bad. Good. We really need to update. I mean, not update, but get another tractor. That way we don't have to hook and unhook and all that good stuff. Uh, go down here and park the... Oh, we still have a little bit more now. I forgot about this. I almost forgot about it, folks. Baylor right here. Where's our combine? Oh, right there is. Combine's done, so. Are you still good? That's, that's just going to be one trailer, folks, the way it looks. Why is it always on the wrong side? So we get a bigger combine, we won't have to worry about this. Empty out. So folks, uh, I really don't know about any news or anything. Uh, the time y'all watch this will be a couple days after Halloween for y'all, but it's just the next day for me. Um, I really don't want to confuse y'all. But, uh, well, it's not confusing y'all. It's just kind of a couple days late for y'all when I talk about this. Kind of confusing me in a way, I guess. But, uh, as far as I know on the news, we ain't had no tragedy. I figure Halloween would be a bad, a bad, uh, experience because of the killer clowns and all that junk. But I ain't watched the news, so 
far as the only thing we had, we had a bad hayride experience. I don't know whereabouts in the county it, it was, but it, it was close to my home, you know, in Mississippi County. But it was, sort of, it was uh, three people died on a hayride, and I'm sorry to hear that. But uh, other than that, I think Halloween went pretty good. Uh, most of the places around here wouldn't let adults wear clown costumes. So I only seen like two kids had clown masks on. So it's it's kind of sad, you know. Bad people do all this, and it takes away from the kids and stuff, and adults trying to have fun. <sighs> but you know that's part of it, folks. This is beans. I don't think we can lay down anything. No, I don't give us an option, so. We're going to hire a worker. Uh, pick up some bales. So I said, what's happening? But the, the arm went back in place. All right, folks. That's eight bales. I would say, you know, I wish in some way this would transfer them over to another trailer. Like that big low boy, if we could put a lot of bales on it. But uh, folks, on my other map, it, I was playing with it. It don't even have tie downs on it. It's just mostly the hay trailers. So that kind of sucks. But yeah, if the big low boy would have tie downs on it. We put these hay bales on it. You know, if we can have a faster way of doing it. Taking each one and setting them on there might take a little while. Of course, we could get the, the wrap bell grabber, and it would help. Alright folks, I want to put feed up in there, so I'm going to take these, what I need to do is cut this tree down, and have it where our bales will stack right here, but I'm going to unload these here. So we got 11 piggies now. Uh oh, oh, don't fall yet. I guess I should look ground level. Man, I wish we let uh, put the forks on this tractor. Yeah, they kind of messy right there, folks. Yeah, I just wondered something. And I know they said something about shovel and and stuff, you know. About cleaning up the pigs. Well, we should have a shovel where we can just scoop it up and throw it back in. I think that would be pretty neat. Let's see. We still got two. Uh oh. Gotta edit that out. Going back down here, and then we'll swap over, check on our combines. That one should be done or full by now. But yeah, when I had the forks or the bucket on the front of this, I could have went ahead and cleaned up. Now, if I'm not mistaken. If I'm not mistaken, I think one of the other tractors I bought's got the front end attachment to it. Okay, see that gives us a little bit of right in there. Right, let's check on the combine. Yeah, he's done. Yeah, that's a good thing. Mm. Well, he ain't made that much. 
year on Saturday. Twenty-seven percent. I don't know. Beans gonna make that good or not? That's gonna be kind of rough. I think the prices are on up well. All right, we're gonna throw our beacons on here. Hope nobody passes us. I don't guess this road here gets traffic or not. I guess I got my traffic on. I ain't seen no cars come down. That's another thing, folks. You turn your traffic on and off. I guess it's for single player, too. But we're going to bring our combines over here when they're done and so we can wash them off and put them in the sheds. Uh, he's going to be pretty good, so I think this guy can hold him. It won't take but a second right over here and dump him out. Of. We'll probably just use the grain buggy for that anyway. So, well, not grain buggy, but the auger wagon. And I'm going to go ahead and just. We're going to park these here. Uh, go find our plow. And, uh, yeah. I need to empty out the auger way I can take it over to the combine first. Before I get too carried away here. Okay, we got our plow, so go ahead and hook up and I'll switch over. Uh, let's do this guy here. We're going to see this is all the all the wheat we got so we're going to go ahead and drop it off. See if we can drop it off. I'm glad to cut all these trees here folks. It gives it just a little bit more open so it looks a little better. All right, we can dump. Yay! That'll save a lot of trips there. Well, make sure ain't nobody coming. I wish we could put roads in too. I guess I could plow, then cultivate so it looks smooth. Pretend that's a road. We wouldn't have no crossing there. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go ahead and empty him out while we're over here, so we'll be switching back and forth, and uh, then we're gonna start back on the billet and stuff. That way we can get that tractor plowing. Might go ahead and start him plowing anyway. Uh, the bale is gonna get kind of tricky. I done took eight up to the pigs. The sheep don't require none. So folks, what's left gonna have to be hauled a long ways away. A long ways. And I just had an idea. Just had an idea pop in my head, and uh, it's not a good one, folks. It involves spending money. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. We don't need to spend money. But it's going to help us with these hay bales, so that'd be a good thing. I think. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get him started. We're going to run on down here and pick up some more bales real quick. Folks, the best thing I know to get these bales out of this field quick is just pick them up and drop them over to the side. That way we can keep him rolling. Because it's going to take a while to plow. We don't have a, I guess we do have a couple tractors free now. 
But uh, I don't really want to buy another plow. Not yet. We need other stuff. And y'all probably wondering what the heck I'm talking about buying, so. That's the last one. What we're going to do. Sorry to close my nose and itching like crazy. This thing fit through here. Yeah, barely. Okay. Yeah! Bad mistake, bad mistake, bad idea. Okay. I'm just going to scoot up a little bit. We're going to drop them here so they'll be out of the weather. Until we get a chance to haul them down to the house. And just in case you're wondering why I'm not picking them up as I go. You know, I want to start over here, pick them up that way. Which he'll never catch me right now, but just in case something does happen. We'll have, you know, this big area here cleared out. Ah, hit that with the track. Folks, I have seen one of them on YouTube once before. If this tractor's had that thing on the front that pushes, well, it's the square bales, that would push it around where it line them up to go into the thing. And I thought that was neater than snot boogers. Oh, wait. What? Well, snot boogers? What the heck? Where I got that from. Anyway, folks. Let's see if I'm back up in here. We're going to drop these. No, I'm going to check on the other combine. Because I mainly want to get the horror. Ah, no! Oh. Me and my big foot. Oh, my God. What did I do? It's going to be a mess to pick up. I went to... thought I was hitting the brake and now I hit the gas pedal, folks. Oh, my goodness. Oh, well. I guess... Oh, look at that. I guess it's a good thing I'm the boss. Because if I was the boss and I happened somebody else, I probably would have fired him. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Wouldn't that be a neat feature I would put in the game? One of the, ah! Like one of the workers do something stupid and say, You're fired! I'd be firing everybody probably. Oh, man. But one bell short from having let's see three times eight is twenty-four. Twenty-four bells. I'm just gonna uh, go ahead and leave him over here. Uh look back up to the wind roller. See folks, this is what you know, if I had another tractor, I could be having him wind row everything. All right, see what he does. All right, see, stop. Rehire. And now he's rolling. Okay. Let's hope for the best. Kind of bounce still going. 30%. Okay. Plow's gone, one of those gone. There, oh crap. See, we had a, had another tractor, folks. See, he just stopped. Why? Why are you doing this to me? Get back to work. All right, we're going to start them here. We're 
go try them again. Uh, he, he should be able to handle this and that. Uh, folks, all right, he's doing this so we can keep an eye on him. Ooh. We're going to need something with speed. This guy's got 40 mile an hour. Our pickup truck can't carry it. So and it's going to take forever with a tractor. And I really want to get a semi anyway. I know this ground kind of hurts, but we do have the bank paid back. So maybe, just maybe, we can do this. I'm going to go ahead and buy this guy. I need to sell late because, see, he's 172, but he's just really too big right now. He'd be. Uh, good for highway use, but this guy's good for out in the field. So we're going to put the back attacher on it so we can pull the bell picker up. Uh, we're going to go with the wide tires so we can use that in the field. And of course, you know it, I got to have the rims matching. It's this me, folks. I'm sorry, but you know, I probably should have went with like a light gray, like a, something like that. But anyway, we just bought us a trick. And folks, I want to check on one more thing. It's not much, but I think this and a couple other things will help us out. I'm going to go majorly in debt, folks. See, he stopped again. This is what I've been doing. Since he gets part of it like that, I'll go ahead and finish it out. I guess I'll just go ahead and start like that and then hire and catch him on the ends, I guess. Kind of about done, so I'm gonna park the green buggy here. Mm. Right. He done good all the way around. He even got the short loads, that's good. Yeah, our guy's out doing that, let's go look at him real quick. See? He's turning back against that way. I don't know why. Giants, what what's the deal? He worked it's gotta be something wrong somewhere on my map because he worked excellent on my other map. Well, almost excellent. I I'd say fair. I think what it is is the header of the combine because when I used them on my other map it was the smaller combines so we'll give them a round of that bout approach again let me uh, get these ends right down here cut and then we'll go look at our truck I want to get all of our crops out in case we have demand. Well, it's probably won't be no time soon, but we can hope and pray, huh? Alright. Go ahead and get our pipe out. Try not to hit the tractor. Alright folks, looky here. Looky, looky, looky. Ain't it pretty? Wish I could put a tag on the front here that says Mr. Blue. Have on the door, Mr. Blue Farms. 
That would be so neat. But folks, that is the bag attacher right there. If you don't get it, you can't pull no any other trailer, so Let's get inside looking inside. Look through there, folks. It is identical to a freight liner. I don't know. I guess licensing stuff with uh, giants and stuff, they had to call it a lizard trip. Everything, I mean, is down to a freight liner. Wow. Except for the air breather being on the outside here, I've never seen one on the outside of a freight liner. Now, Peterbilt's had. It's uh, okay, our prowl's doing good. We got all the bells out, so we don't have to worry about him no time. So. Oh, folks! Oh my god! I gotta hop out. I gotta look at something. Oh, uh, Jim Bob in there, I guess. Maybe Billy Bob was driving when I go. Uh, let's see, did I get? No, I didn't get the trailer yet. <sighs> folks. I hate to do this, but don't have no choice. Don't have no choice. We got to buy equipment. We got to do it. I don't wear or make our farm bigger. Now I'm maxing the loan out, but I'm not going to go ahead and save the game while I'm here. Just in case. Just in case. All right, go back in there. Go to here. Buy our trailer. There's no upgrade for it. This is standard trailer that is awesome okay all right 87 there folks one other thing one other thing here 64,000 I'm gonna go ahead and get some bobcat and probably put it at the pigs maybe no, we're going to put it to cows for right now. So we're going to go ahead and buy him. And we need a bucket. No, I didn't say that. I said bucket. <laughs> this way, folks. Uh, this is all the other stuff you can get from it. This it is pretty good. It cuts trees down, lay them where you want them. That picks trees up. You got the stunt grinder. Oh, got a log fork. A mirror fork. We can use a bucket for it. The only other thing I want to get is this here, the bell spike. And that should take care of us down at the house. Uh, 121 left. I wish there was a, there's another spot left right here. I hope the uh, chrome big windbrowler comes to back for us. And folks, 94 and Let me back out and look at something real quick. Okay. The pigs are going to need corn, wheat, and canola, and potatoes. Okay. What I was thinking about is buying some one, two, three, four. They need four trailers. Uh. Let's just hold off on that. 121,000. What kind of tractor can we get for 121,000? Oh, that thing is really much nice. Locker is from 145 miles. 19. Really? 
56. Front loader attachment, yes. I like for all of them. Let's see. Oh man. Hold off on that, folks. Uh, tell you what. Front load attachment. Uh, engine setup. I still gonna put it on. One twelve. I put it at one twelve. I hate to do it, but we need it. Okay. One more thing, folks. I'll be done. I promise. I'll be out. Oh, man. So I'll get this one. And hope I didn't go wrong. Because we need this. Let's have enough for the bucket. Oh goodness, oh goodness, oh goodness. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright folks, that's enough spinning for now. Let's go. Plow's still good. What the heck? Okay. Yeah. Y'all seen that folks. Also, see, it looks like I'm lagging a little bit too. Yeah, it should pick you up. Let's see. This is what he done to me on the other field. Okay. And this is what I had to do. So, I guess y'all get to see it anyway. These are good on this end. See, that looks like it's going to be good. Yeah, good. Got to go to this one here. And do this one. Yeah, perfect. Straight up a little bit. And folks, we are done with rolling that bit. We're going to jump them in this one. And wow. Hope we don't do that stupid on this one. Alright. We work. We work. Let's see. What are you? Hey, we got baby girl back. Ah, dang, baby girl. The blind lady. <laughs> They're all blind, it's like it blind I saw, so we ain't nothing wrong with blinds. Oh, look at all this goodness, folks. Look at all these goodies. Oh, wow, this is a little bitty tiny baby. Let me zoom in here a little bit. See, we're gonna put the bucket on the truck. And uh, we're gonna have to stretch it out first. And put that back up. That helps. Where did that come from? Did I miss 
something about it, see? Folks, I don't remember that. I really don't. I don't remember buying it. I'll go back and watch the video, I guess. Not unless I did it on the other episodes. Did I do it when I went and bought the food? Well, this is what I like about this trailer. Uh, how do I do it? There. Ah, here we go. I'm going to stretch this bad boy out. I uh, don't think we need that much room, but... Uh, oh, but there we go. Drop it down, drive up on it. Well, still doing good. He's doing somewhat decent. Maybe I'm not starting him right. Maybe I just need to do two rows at a time. Oh, I forgot about him. Oh, funny. Make sure the combine's empty. We're going to drive the combine back. Folks, I hate to do this, but we are running out of time. No, I don't want to go. I want to stay here and make videos for y'all. I'm going to come right back in and make the next episode, but is this not fair? Oh boy, nothing coming. I never did look. I still ain't seen no cars. I'm going to check my... I'm glad I got tractor car. Uh, folks, before I go, I do want to talk about... I've been seriously thinking about doing a live stream. Uh... I've never done one. I don't know if this computer would do one. I uh, really don't know about going about it, about testing. Uh, but uh, what is today? Today is Tuesday. Like I said, you know, a couple days behind. Well, right, folks, we're going to put this over here. But, uh, well, I'm not behind, but you know what I mean. I'm recording my videos in advance, so. Drop that there. Will this hook up to the others? That's a smaller. Nope. Dang. Oh well. Well, folks, all those bales I turned over. That's what I got this for. And plus, we can take a bale, stretch this bad boy out, and stack them this way, maybe too tall, and go real slow, and be able to take it down to the cows. Now that's my game plan. That's, well, you know, there's going to be something we can work on. Man, I still don't remember that man. It's pleasant. Uh, the reason why I'm doing the buckets up on here because they're flatter and they sit better on this. I think this bucket looks bigger than the one on the track. Uh, I think I'll make this lower this a little bit more. But yeah, I've been wanting to do a YouTube uh, live stream and see what it's about. I don't know too much about it. I'm going to do some research on this. Oh. Really, they, what I've read so far, you can take your Elgato game catcher and go through it and go live. So if that's true. That would be pretty neat. So, there we go. Want to poke the tractor go? Poke them in the butt? No, can't do that. Alright. We're going back on up. 
So you just hook it up. The only thing about it, old folks, you can't uh, uh put on down. Uh up and down. Okay. So you go pull it in, see what it does to the tractor. It don't scoot with it. So whatever setting you set it at, you'll have to leave it at. Yeah. Which is the way you raise it a little bit higher too, because this takes a curve. But what we're gonna do, we're gonna drop the bobcat off at the cows. It handles pretty good, but it don't lock nothing down. Well, at least none of my C does anything. See? It just extends out. Well, there's another one I got to edit. Edit alert. Edit alert. Got to edit. Oh, man, I thought you'd go out this way. Please don't knock none of them off. Like I said, it's pretty stable as long as you do, don't do nothing stupid like drive 100 mile an hour. That's why I want to come out this way. It's right across from that. Probably could have drove Bobcat here, but since we got two attachments, I figure I'd just do it this way. And I need to check on the uh, let me check on the one really. Ah! Oh my goodness. What is he doing? Y'all see this? I got to report this to somebody. This is just ain't right. Oh my God. How did he get through the grain silos barn? I'll fold you up. You done. Well, not quite yet. Let's see what kind of mess he's got up here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Folks. Oh. Oh man. I just. I just don't know. I just don't know what to say. I've never seen anybody this bad. I could really go somewhere with this, uh, but I'm not because I don't want to get myself in trouble with the blondes. And I probably just got myself in trouble with the blondes. But anyway, yeah. It's time to go, folks. On this note here, it's time to go. It's time to go. I don't know why he done this. Uh, folks, I'm going to do this off screen. Let's get our uh, Argo wagon back over to the shop before something else happens. We're going to unload this and look at our totals and see where everything's at. And then we're going to say goodbye to the next episode, okay? I like that. That's neat. Both combines need to be washed. I'll do that off screen. Uh, let's see here. Let's see here. Uh, oh, I'm on the track. No wonder. I've got truck. Ah, I got to add to that. What's wrong with these people? That's one thing about recording during the daytime, folks. I am going to get this unloaded and clean up the cows real quick. These things are so particular about how they drive. I'm just going to drop this right here for right now. Time being. Ah! I got to edit that. That's three. I don't know who crops I'm driving in. They're going to be mad at me. Okay. 
Whoa. Easy now. All right. I don't know how much is. I should have seen how much this bucket holds. It's a big bucket. All right, folks. We're gonna look at our map. Uh, all the wagons should be done. Let's see. Make sure. Yeah, he's empty out. We're gonna uh, look at our map real quick. Oh my god, the sheep's down to 2%. Uh, got 20% wool, that ain't bad. Water and grass is okay for now. Probably do that next episode or next. Pigs are dirty. Uh, yeah, food and stuff's good. Cows are at 1%. So watch this. I'm gonna clean it up real quick. Go back in, show y'all. This is pretty neat. Let me like see the bucket. Well, about right there, I guess. Okay, yeah. This does. I love how this thing turns. Strings all right, but it's just ah. Gotta get used to it, I guess. Okay, folks. That's all it is to clean the cans. And then just dump it back in here. Ah, Betsy, hush. Yeah, look at there, folks. They're walking around. I gotta get straw up here ASAP. But I'm trying to do some more missions. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we got a big old pile of grass over here. Park this bucket right here. I'll uh, do the rest of that later. We got to, uh, Get this tractor up to the shop. Uh, there we go. Sometimes this particular now once again. See how it does? Okay, it's trying to scoot it with it. Okay. Alright folks, uh oh wait, yeah, let's go back in. Okay, it's probably because I got on one time I uh, updated it, but they're clean, so. But anyway, we're running out of time, folks. Uh, I'll come back in the next episode and uh, see where we go from there, okay? Uh, see, I got a good way of getting out of here. But anyway, y'all make sure y'all hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel if y'all new. It gives y'all a way to, you know, see my other episodes and stuff. Also, after you subscribe, right beside the subscribe button, there's a little bell icon. You want to make it look like it's ringing, okay? Just click on it. A pop up little dialog box. Click that little box. Hit OK. And then uh, every time I post a video, y'all be alerted. Every time y'all got it set up through email or whatever, usually. And uh, yeah, folks, uh, do that. And that way, every time I get a video, y'all get one, a notification. And like I said, hit that like button, subscribe, set my alert notifications, and then. Uh, Share me with your friends and family, folks. Let's see if this guy's ready for another mission. I might have to plant or fertilize. We'll have to plant, folks. Hmm. 3,000. I'm going to go ahead and do this off screen. And like I said, hit that like button, subscribe, share. All the whole nine yards, folks. And I will catch y'all next time.
And uh, Mr. Blue, y'all have a blessed day and catch you next time.